guys in this video we will see some really cool and time saving illustrator tricks that takes away a lot of the design work. So number one, create shapes like a pro with the shape builder tool. The shape builder tool allows you to merge any number and form of shapes into one. This is a very important tool in designing logos and creating custom illustrations. For example, here I have a square and a circle which I want to merge into one shape. All we need to do is select the two shapes with the selection tool and then from the toolbar select the shape builder tool and then just click and drag over the areas that you want in your shape. Also you can remove areas with the shape builder tool. Just press alt and click and drag over the areas that you want to remove. Number 2. Don't worry if you don't have a dual screen setup for designing. In Illustrator, you can split up screens to see a bigger and smaller version of your design and tweak them accordingly. Go to Window and then click on New Window. This will open up the same window. Again, go to Window, Arrange and then Time. Now you have a split screen. You can also do this for different windows. Number 3. Mix colors and create your own color palette with the Blend tool. Create any shape of two colors that you want to mix. Here I have created a set of four. Then select the two shapes or colors you want to blend. Go to Object, Blend and Blend Options. Select specified steps in Spacing. I set this to four so that I get four tones of the color. Again, select the two colors and then select the Blend tool from the toolbar on the left and just simply click on the two colors to blend them. Number 4. Create guides using the rectangle tool. All you need to do is create a rectangle in the size of the artboard, then go to object, path and then split into grid. Select the number of rows and columns and then click OK. You can also adjust the stroke of these lines, then select all and right click on the grid. Select make guides. Now you have the guide ready which will help you make designs precisely. Number 5. Whenever you are copying an object multiple times, you don't need to press Alt or Ctrl C plus V every time you do it. All you need to do is copy the object once, pressing Alt plus click and drag and then press Ctrl plus D to duplicate multiple times in that particular direction. You can also do it with a group of objects. Number 6. You can easily create your patterns in Illustrator. Just open up the swatches panel. Go to Window and then Swatches. Now click and drag the pattern into the Swatches panel to create your own pattern. You can then apply this pattern to any object you want. Number 7. The Pathfinder tool. When we select two objects and minus the top object from the bottom one, the Pathfinder tool usually removes the top object permanently. You can see this in the Layers panel. If you can't see the Pathfinder panel, just go to Window and select the Pathfinder option. When you press Alt and click minus front, it saves all the shapes in different layers. You can see it here in the Layers panel. Number 8. You can easily recolor your artwork using the Recolor tool. Select the object or design, then go to Edit, Edit Colors and then Recolor Artwork. It also has a library of colors which you can try on for recoloring your artwork. You will find more advanced options to change the colors. Number 9. The Join option. You can join multiple vertices in two simple ways. First is, right click on the Shaper tool and select Join and just draw a closed loop around the vertices you want to join. Secondly, you can select the vertices with the Direct Selection tool and then press Ctrl J on the keyboard. Number 10. The Pen tool can be used to modify the stroke direction for strokes like this. All we need to do is just select the Pen tool and just click on the anchor points to reverse the direction of the stroke.